the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, I'm going to help this noob reach second C using the new sword, Jite. There you go. So it is being held by Smokey, the level 20 mob here in Starting Island. So let's get it. But first, we need to reach level 20, so start eating fried chicken. That's the fastest way to reach level 6. There you go. Eat 3. And after that, buy your first sword, the katana. Guys, again, our stats, we will allot it to some of the defense and mostly on the sword. So what a way to start defeating mobs using a sword, right? Don't worry, we will change it later. So you can grind here with the soldiers until you reach level 10. And after that, Clown Pirates, starting level 10, to reach level 20. So guys, you can go with the fried chicken quest if you want, as long as you reach level 20, okay? Okay, so let's say you've reached level 20, now we can start grinding with Smokey and try to get the GTA sword. Okay, so use your X skill, Z skill, dodge dodge, and use it again to defeat him. So guys, fast forward, we were able to get it. At level 40, I'm gonna show you the sword. Let's change it in the inventory. There you go. This is an uncommon sword. It has two skills, but we haven't unlocked it yet. For the first skill, I think you need 200 mastery. So let's go to Tashi. And I think we will unlock the first skill at level 52. There you go. 200 mastery requirement, tornado. Yes, 52. Okay, so after killing this, we will move on to our next island to continue leveling up. Check this out. We can go underwater. <laughs> Really cool, right? So Pirate Island is the next island to grind. So as you can see, we're gonna start with the Cloud Pirates. Guys, here we cannot use Tornado properly. So I suggest you can use it. You can lower use Tornado or just normal click your enemies. Check that out. It's very easy. <laughs> Goal here is to reach level 75. There we go. And after that, at 75, we can start defeating the Cloud. So again, Z skill and use your normal skill. It's quite easy because we have defense and some sword damage. So the goal here is to reach level 120. After that, moving on, Soldier Island. We're gonna start here with the Captain. Don't forget to buy the sword, guys. Okay, so now just use your Z skill. There you go. And your left clicks to defeat it. It's very easy. You will unlock your second skill when you reach level 130 plus. That is the Quick Slash. So let's check it out guys, Z skill and the quick slash. Guys, this sword is very good for single target enemies. So at level 145, you can start defeating the axe hand again. Simple Z, dodge to avoid the damage and X skill, quick slash. As you can see, it's very easy, you just need to be patient while waiting for it to spawn. The goal here is to reach level 200, and after that, next island, the shark island. So again, we skip a quest here. We're gonna start with the Karat Fishman. Z skill, X skill is the key. So our goal here is to reach level 230. Let's reach this level first before we move on to our next target. Here we go, the Sharkman. Again, 230. Let's check this out. Z skill, X skill, and after that, go straight to the quest giver. Most likely, the Sharkman has spawned. So we're gonna take advantage of this. Same strategy, use your Tornado Quick Slash. So the goal here is to reach level 350. And after that, we can now move on to our next island or ship. <laughs> and that ship is the Chef Ship. So here, we're gonna start and end with the Weapon Man. Yes, we're skipping the Black Leg. Because they're so far apart, right? Okay, stat check before we leave here, 450 defense, 958 sword. Oh, and by the way, just to like add another Soru, I went to Rox to buy the Black Leg. We won't be putting stats on the melee, but this one already has the Z skill. And again, you can use this as another soul. And the cooldown is even faster. Okay, that's it. Back to grinding. Again, our goal here is to reach level 450. And after that, we can now proceed to our next island, the Snow Island. There you go. So here we're gonna start with the King Snow. Same strategy as always, Z and X skill. 
The goal here is to reach level 500 and after reaching that you can now proceed to our next target mob. That mob is Chopper the Heavy Man indicated here again at 500. So he's easy to defeat you can even add his skills. There you go. So to make things faster you can defeat him. Use your Z skill, Black Leg and Soru. There you go. Defeat King of Snow. Go back to him. The goal here is to reach level 625. But I kinda exceeded it <laughs> to show you too how you grind. Next island, Desert Island. We're gonna start with the Bombed Man, 625. Z skill and next skill is enough. To make things faster, you can go directly to Candle Man. There is a high chance that you will get damaged. So guys, we are gonna buy the Observation Hockey. You need like 1.5 million to buy it. So after this, let's head straight to Sky Island. There you go. You can use your Z skill and your Soru to go up here to make it faster. There you go. 1.5 million Observation Hockey. Now we can pack some of the skills of the Bam Band and the Candleman. So moving on, at level 725, we can start defeating the King of Sand. So guys, you need to be patient here because he has some attacks that might drain all your observation hockey. But it's he's easy to kill. It's one tornado X skill. The goal here is to reach level 800. Okay, so after that, you can now go to the Sky Islands. Go a step higher because we're gonna skip the uh, we call this Sky Bandits. We're gonna start with the Ballman 850. So guys, leveling up here is really really fast. See that? Same with the Sharp Man. After that, get the quest. He's already there. Make sure that your skills are on cooldown. So guys, the goal here is to reach level 1050. Yes, you heard it right, 1050. And after that, 50 more levels here with the Rumble Man. You might get the pole, but we won't be using that. Again, after you hit him, just dodge and use your Quick Slash. Okay, so now... Once you reach level 1100, we will go to our next target island. And that island is the Bubble Island. Before we start grinding, buy the Buso Haki here. There you go. So this increases your defense and your melee and sword damage. So let's try it out. See that? Damage 3800. And his damage to you is 2.2k. 2000. So once you activate your Haki, check it out, damage to you is 1000, your damage is 4000. So it increased your damage and your defense. So here we're gonna continue grinding with the leader. The goal here is to reach level 1150. There you go, and after that, we're gonna proceed to the next grinding area. The pasta, guys, grinding here is really, really fast. I'm telling you, same with the Sharkman or the Bowman. If it him, Go back to the quest giver. And most likely he's there. See that? The only thing that will make it slower is the cooldown of your skills. So make sure to hit him, not like this one. See that? I made a mistake. Avoid doing that. Just be calm. There you go. And defeat Pasta. Okay. So the goal here, guys, is to reach level 1325. And after that, we can now proceed to the next island. That island is the final grinding island for this episode, the Lobby Island. Here it is. So in this island, we have two mobs that we will defeat simultaneously. First off, the Wolf. He's easy to defeat, don't worry about that. Just one Z and X skill again. Next up, we have the Giraffe. So again, you will defeat them simultaneously until you reach level 1400. There you go again. Goal here is 1,400, and after that, we can now proceed to our final, uh, what do you call this mob? Leo. So, Roblucci in one piece. There you go. So, 1 4. The goal here is to reach level 1,500. Why 1,500, game or not? Because that is the requirement for you to get a quest that will then enable you to go to the second scene. Okay, so again. 1,500, here we go, we've reached it. Now for the quest, you need to go to the War Island go and look for the, this dude, talk to him. He will then ask you to look for the map. And that map is located in the Fishland here. Let's check this out. 
let's just uh, make it faster if this is one of the luckiest account that I made why it's just one kill guys you can kill anyone here okay any mob here will give you the map but just the first kill we were able to get the map see that we saved so much time because of that here it is the map now we will then need to return to the traveler guys avoid dying okay before giving the map and after that you are now permitted to go to the second sea how go to the starting island here it is talk to the elite pirate in the port and he will then send you to the second sea and that's it guys for this video final thoughts yes GTA is a very good uh what do you call this sword you can use it to grind really really fast but is it good in the second C? I think no. Just unlock the X blade, X uh, Christmas blade. Sorry, and we're about to find out. I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna unlock the Christmas blade and reach max level using that. So watch out for that. Again, guys, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. Again, this is Gamer Nom. Gamer Nom out.